There is a mantra which could have avoided this man from collapsing and dying while playing dandia. Did you know that this year over 10 people from Gujarat have been reported to die of heart attack while playing dandia? Many celebrities have also been reported of dying of heart attacks while in the gym or doing extreme cardiovascular activities. In this video, we will learn that one magic mantra which can reduce the chances of you facing heart issues. So stay with us till the end. Now pay attention to this mantra and say this after me. Vithala, Vithala. No, no, it's not Vithala. It's Vithala. Tha. Now say this correctly along with me loud and clear. Vithala, 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 Vithala. Did you notice a sensation in your chest area? Those of you who actually participated must have definitely noticed a mild hit around the chest caused by the vibrations while uttering this sound. Now let us learn a little more about this sound. Over 800 years ago, imagine if you had to cover 250 kilometers by foot. Even today, walking such a long distance in spite of the facilities is not easy. But still, people used to easily walk those days. I'm talking about the Pandarpur Yatra. The yatris walked for around 18 to 20 days before they reached the Lord Vithala Temple in Pandarpur, Maharashtra. People of all ages took up this intense yatra, which involved rigorous pathways, weather conditions, and was an intense cardio activity, especially for the older people. But did you know that most people easily managed to go through this yatra with the support of this powerful Sanskrit mantra, Vithala, which they continuously chanted along the way. Inspired by this, a group of researchers conducted a study to explore where the energy of these yatris came from, and specifically wanted to understand how the word vitthala is connected to the human heart and its physical activity. They did a study on a group of 30 people between the age group of 20 to 60 years, which included both atheists and theists. During the test, the participants chanted vitthala for nine minutes. Before and after the chanting, the blood pressure, ECG, and 2D echo were conducted. The research went on for a year. The study revealed that chanting helped in improving the pumping action of the heart, as well as regulating the pulse, blood pressure, and the heart rate. And also, improvement in the energy levels of the participants were seen. There are references of the word vitthala connected with the heart chakra, also known as anahata. So the study did energy profiling of Anahata Chakra using a biofield viewer and electroscanning method. A statistically significant increase was observed in the green pixel parameter, which is also known as the color energy of the heart chakra. It is also important to note that this chant is not a substitute treatment to those diagnosed with heart conditions. They should continue their medications as advised by the doctor. For most regular people, the food and lifestyle, especially for the ones living in urban areas, is not conducive. For an ideal cardiac health, most packed food is filled with palm oil, bad cholesterol, refined sugar, and moreover, the urban lifestyle itself lacks physical activity and is not supportive for a healthy heart. As you could notice by just chanting this mantra a few times in the beginning of this video, you could easily feel the sensations instantly. Imagine what effects it can have if you make use of this sound daily for just a few minutes a day. Sanskrit as a language is not mainly about the meaning. but mostly about the sensation the vibrations created within the human body each one of us whether young or old may have some minor conditions related to the heart which may usually surface when we do intense physical activity when our ancient rishis and yogis have already given us this powerful and simple tool let's make use of it in our day to day lives and enjoy a strong and happy heart share this video with all those whom you care about and to continue learning follow rishika anket for more such topics